Okay, I wanted to introduce you today to our Generation 2 valve robot. It's a smart home device that mounts over an existing ball valve to uh, allow you to control your water main. Um, and the idea is you, uh, you pair it with um, water sensors so that in the case of a leak, it uh, automatically shuts off the water or you can just manage it from your uh, your smartphone if you have a you know a cottage or a second home so basically uh, the new version has some improved torque uh, along with some other features that uh, include it uh, supports a plugged in wired uh, sensor as well as an output for a sleigh version for uh, a condominium kits because condos um, typically have uh, two valves one for cold and one for hot um, it mounts over an existing ball valve, as I said, and we support half inch, um, three quarter, and uh, one inch valves of uh, various types. Uh, there's solder type, threaded type, um, and uh, uh, PEX type or shark bite uh, type. So it's very simple. Um, you install it over an existing ball valve. There's two screws, one here, one here, and we have a bracket for each of the sizes that's included with the kit, half inch, three quarter, or one inch. And as a matter of fact, uh, with the improved torque, we've actually even tested it up to uh, a one and a half inch uh, valve. We're still testing that. We don't really recommend it at this point, but just to show you the extra torque that it has. So you can open and close it directly with uh, the controller here, which has now been separated from the motor. Or you can use your phone once it's uh, paired to your system. I just called it uh, water, now it's off. I can turn it back on. But the real idea is you set it up uh, routine so that if there's a uh, leak, it automatically shuts off the water. This is actually our new um, water sensor. What's cool about it is that it has a base that you can snap on that supports a wired sensor. So you can snap this base on and mount it on the wall and then just place the sensor. Or you can just take the device as it is and with the probes on the bottom you just put it in place in the laundry room or the bathroom or by the hot water heater and it'll it'll shut off the water if it gets wet so I'll just show you here so there's some water I'm just gonna put this in the water and it shuts off the water it's blinking lights there you might not be able to see and uh, you can get an alert to your phone when that happens as well I'm just going to take that out and the way that works is it shuts off the water and it takes a human to get involved to turn the water back on again even when this gets dry it uh, it doesn't shut the water back on so I'll put the water back on so you can see there it shows off and I'll put it back on and that's it thanks